18-year-old Toronto man Sammy Yatim is dead after police fired on him nine times following a brief standoff which had him cornered in an empty streetcar armed only with a knife. Police are receiving heavy criticism for what many are calling extreme and unnecessary force. The 505 route streetcar was westbound on Dundas Street around midnight on Saturday, July 27. Witnesses say Yatim pulled a knife on passengers and told everybody on board to get off. The driver and passengers then emptied onto Dundas Street and Bellwoods Avenue. Police arrived shortly after to find your team still in the streetcar, alone. One officer draws his weapon amid commands for your team to put down his knife. Your team does not immediately comply. Officers yell, don't move, before three shots are fired. The video shows your team taking a step towards the entrance and an officer firing. Six more shots follow. Moments later, another officer appears to use a taser on the fallen team. He was then taken to hospital and pronounced dead. One witness described what he saw. The only person on the streetcar was the man in question. And I don't know what so was the driver, said. The driver was off. He was, he was off. There. To, my, I, to my recollection, he was off. Yeah. And then I heard pop, 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 and then pop, 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 pop. Yeah. And then the ambulance showed up and they're pretending to do CPR on this guy. Obviously, if there was a chance of saving him, they wouldn't be still... Yeah, they wouldn't be standing there. Standing there. They'd be off the hospital. They, they, killed, they killed the guy. It was yeah. the... Now, maybe he pulled a gun on him. I don't know. Yeah. But they killed, they killed him. Yeah. Uh, Sammy Yatim arrived in Canada from Syria with his family five years ago and had no history of mental illness. His sister took to Twitter to vent her grief and anger at his death. 